Have you ever wondered about the sheer size of the largest dinosaurs that once roamed our Earth? These colossal creatures defy our understanding of scale, dwarfing even the biggest animals alive today. This is the world we're about to explore, a world where the giants of the past reign supreme. We'll be ranking these dinosaurs based on a few key criteria. Size is the most obvious one. We're talking about the largest dinosaurs after all, but size isn't just about height. We're also considering weight, a testament to their mass and physical presence. Not to forget length, from the tip of their nose to the end of their tail, a measure of their grandeur. Each dinosaur on our list has been thoroughly researched and scrutinized, their dimensions estimated based on the most reliable scientific data available. This isn't just about numbers, though. It's about appreciating the awe-inspiring diversity and magnitude of life on Earth. So, without further ado, let's dive into this prehistoric journey. Starting our countdown at number 10, we have the Gigantoraptor. This colossal creature roamed the Earth during the late Cretaceous period, making its home in what is now known as Mongolia. Measuring up to 26 feet in length and standing at over 16 feet tall, the Gigantoraptor was not only massive but also boasted unique features that set it apart from other dinosaurs of its era. Unlike its contemporaries, the Gigantoraptor was a feathered dinosaur. That's right, a dinosaur with feathers. Its size, combined with its feathered exterior, made it a truly distinctive sight. These feathers were not just for show, though. They played a crucial role in the Gigantoraptor's survival, providing insulation against the harsh climates of its habitat. The Gigantoraptor also had a beak, devoid of teeth, which it used to gobble up small animals and plants, making it an omnivore. This flexibility and diet likely contributed to its massive size. The Gigantoraptor, a truly unique member of the dinosaur kingdom, Moving on to number 9, we encounter the Giganotosaurus. This colossal creature roamed what is now Argentina during the late Cretaceous period, about 99 to 93 million years ago. With its name meaning giant southern lizard, the Giganotosaurus was indeed a giant. It's believed to have grown up to 43 feet in length, making it one of the largest known terrestrial carnivores. But size isn't everything. The Gigantosaurus was also equipped with razor-sharp teeth, each about 8 inches long, perfect for ripping into the flesh of its prey. And its strong, muscular legs allowed it to move quickly, despite its size. Now you might be wondering how the Gigantosaurus compares to the infamous T-Rex. Well, the Gigantosaurus was slightly larger, but the T-Rex had a more powerful bite. Nonetheless, the Gigantosaurus was a formidable predator in its own right. The Gigantosaurus a predator that could give T-Rex a run for its money. At number 8 we have the Argentinosaurus. This colossal creature hails from what is now Argentina, hence its name. It roamed the Earth during the late Cretaceous period, around 90 million years ago. The Argentinosaurus is part of the Titanosaurus family, a fitting name given its titanic size. This dinosaur was truly a marvel of nature, with estimates suggesting it could have reached lengths up to 100 feet and weighed up to 100 tons. That makes it one of the heaviest dinosaurs ever to have walked the Earth. Its colossal size was complemented by a long neck and tail, enabling it to reach vegetation at great heights and distances. The Argentinosaurus is believed to have been a slow mover, but its sheer size would have made it a formidable force against any predator. Despite its size, it was a herbivore, munching on plant life to sustain its massive body. The Argentinosaurus, a true titan of prehistory. Coming in at number 7, meet the Spinosaurus. This fascinating creature, the largest of all carnivorous dinosaurs, roamed the swamps of North Africa during the Cretaceous period. Boasting a length of up to 60 feet, its most striking feature was its sail-like spine, stretching high above its back. This unique adaptation likely served multiple functions, including temperature regulation and display. But don't be fooled by its terrestrial appearance. The Spinosaurus was a semi-aquatic beast, equally adept in water as on land. The Spinosaurus, the dinosaur that swam. At number 6 we have the Titanosaur. The Titanosaur is a spectacle of size, a creature that dominated its environment with sheer bulk. These gentle giants, the largest dinosaurs to have ever walked the earth, hailed from what is now Argentina, with a length of up to 100 feet and a weight that could exceed 70 tons. The Titanosaur was a marvel of nature. Its long neck allowed it to reach the tops of trees, while its robust body was built to support its enormous weight. The Titanosaur, a dinosaur that truly lived up to its name. At number 5, we have the Dreadnoughtus. Its name means fears nothing, 
and with its imposing size it's not hard to see why. The Dreadnoughtus was a titan among dinosaurs, reaching lengths of up to 85 feet and weighing an estimated 65 tons. That's equivalent to about nine African elephants. These colossal creatures roamed the earth around 77 million years ago, primarily in what is now Argentina. Next, at number four, we have the Supersaurus. The name translates to Super Lizard, and it does justice to this enormous creature. The Supersaurus was a long-necked dinosaur that could reach lengths of an astounding 110 feet. That's longer than a blue whale. Its long neck allowed it to reach treetops and gain access to food that other dinosaurs couldn't. This dinosaur made its home in North America around 150 million years ago. Moving on to number three, we have the Brachiosaurus. Brachiosaurus is a genus of sauropod dinosaur that lived in North America during the late Jurassic, about 154 to 150 million years ago. It was first described by American paleontologist Elmer S. Riggs in 1903 from fossils found in the Colorado River Valley in western Colorado, United States. Brachiosaurus is estimated to have been between 59 to 72 feet long. Body mass estimates of the subadult holotype specimen range from 28 to 46 tons. Coming in at number two, we have the Seismosaurus. Its name translates to Earthquake Lizard, and it's easy to imagine the ground shaking with each step this giant took. The Seismosaurus could reach lengths of up to 120 feet, similar to the Argentinosaurus, but weighed a whopping 120 tons. These dinosaurs lived in what is now North America around 152 million years ago. At number one, we introduce the Marapunosaurus. The Marapunosaurus, a species from the late Jurassic period, was recognized for its elongated neck. Speculation suggests that this dinosaur could have been one of the largest in the world, with potential lengths reaching up to 190 feet. Despite its intimidating size, the Mariapunosaurus was a gentle giant that sustained itself on the lush vegetation of its time. The Mariapunosaurus, a true marvel in the prehistoric realm, remained a mystery due to the scarcity of fossils. Only one fossil of this majestic creature has ever been discovered, but tragically was lost. Gregory S. Paul, an eminent researcher famous for his contributions to the field of dinosaur reconstruction, postulated that the Marapunosaurus measured around 131 feet based on existing measurements and field notes associated with the fossil. This estimate is slightly smaller than initial calculations, which hinted at the possibility of the Marapunosaurus reaching lengths of up to 200 feet. Although illustrations of the dinosaur's fossil imply it could have been the largest, the lack of detailed documentation and precise measurements render it challenging to definitively crown the Marapunosaurus as the largest dinosaur ever to roam the Earth. Our journey through the world of the largest dinosaurs now comes to an end. We've journeyed together through the epics, from the feathered menace of the Gigantoraptor, the titanic terror of the Giganotosaurus, to the towering majesty of the Argentinosaurus. We've marveled at the unique sail-backed Spinosaurus and the sheer mass of the Titanosaur. Lastly, we stood in awe of the biggest of them all, a dinosaur so large its name is yet to be etched in stone. Each of these colossal creatures paints a picture of a time long past, a time of giants. Their magnitude is a testament not only to the power of evolution, but also to the boundless diversity of life on our planet. They inspire awe curiosity and a deep respect for the forces that shape our world. Remember, these giants once roamed our planet, a testament to the incredible diversity of life on Earth. Until next time, keep exploring the past, for it holds wonders beyond our wildest imagination.